It's been only three months since the previous version of the SF2000 was released, but yet we have another upgrade. This upgrade is more significant than the previous one because this new SF2000 has the Samsung LM301H EVO diodes, which is rated at 3.14 micromoles per joule. This is 7.5% more efficient than the previous model, which had LM301B diodes. Now, all's not well because I counted all of the LEDs and the new model has 448 Samsung diodes and 42 infrareds, giving this a total of 490 LEDs. This is significantly less than the 606 LEDs in the previous model. Normally, I would say that this is an absolute downgrade, but I tested the lights and what's interesting is that despite having less LEDs, the light actually performed better. The light intensity was slightly higher as well as the power drawn. It's not a significant improvement, but it's still an improvement. So as long as the price isn't higher, the new model is absolutely worth it. A random observation that I noticed is that the placement of the LEDs on the panel is not symmetric. The look of the continuous dimmer has also changed, but the functions are the same. I'll be reviewing this light on a future grow for an actual harvest, but so far, based on what I've measured, it seems to be better. To save 8% on the light, use code SFHWGROW on Amazon or on their website.